man to honor. What a privilege to read the citation of a man with such behemoth-like greatness. A man whose life of systematic operationalization, military, military rationalization, social equalization, and economic polarization has endowed him with an iconic halo. A man who has visited over 31 countries, including Morocco, Costa Rica, Lebanon, Burundi, etc. A man who wishes to be remembered for trying to do good. He has done a lot of good, but he says he just wants to be remembered for trying to do good. That speaks of humility. So, ladies and gentlemen, for his frenetic and altruistic service to humanity, significant contribution to the elevation of the academic and political status of the university, his sacrificial efforts towards the social economic development of the state and the nation, a gentleman of the Jewish qualities and sublimest ingredients, modest, honest, earnest, zesty, feisty, Gentle, sensible, humble, nimble, audible, cherishable, citable, commendable, intelligent, benevolent, competent, effervescent, magnificent, luminescent. Ladies and gentlemen, for the awards of Doctor of Laws, Honoris Causa, Brigadier General, and Tony Uko, retired. Thank you very much. God bless you. By the authority vested in me as Vice Chancellor of the University of Calabar, and in accordance with the provision of the University Statute, I confer on you the degree of Doctor of Law, Honoris Causa, with all the rights and privileges attached thereto. Congratulations. This is a certificate given by us to you, sir, and to all men whom this letter shall come. Be it known that Brigadier General Anthony Upo retired, having complied with all the requirements of the Senate Council and by the authority of Senate, I hereby award you, sir, the Doctor of Laws, LLD, Honoris Cosa, and you are entitled to all the rights, honors, and privileges appertaining thereto. In testimony whereof, we have granted this degree at Calabar, Nigeria, this day, the 11th of March, in the year of our Lord, 2017, under our seal. Congratulations, sir. I think the alumni wants to also decorate our recipient.
Solicitor, Mr. Vice Chancellor, the Council and Senate of the University of Calabar have resolved that honorary degree of Doctor of Science Honoris Causa be conferred on Sir Daniel Nwe Meka Chuku Dozier. I therefore call on the University Orator, Dr. Geneva Glazo, to present Sir Daniel Nweka Chuku Dozier. For his doctorate degree, honoris causa. I'd like to invite uh, Jeremiah Sokoto. I understand he uh, wants to make some remarks before leaving. My pleasure to invite Jeremiah Sokoto. Glazer, please step forward. Standing on existing protocol. I'll be reading the citation on Sir Dr. Daniel Wanneka Chukudazie, KSC, FNSC, on the occasion of the conferment of the Doctor of Science degree by the University of Calabar on this day, March the 11th, 2017. God, in his infinite mercy, always grants honest good deeds. Sir Dr. Daniel Wanneka Chukudazie, the educationist, the philanthropist, the scientist, the business mogul, the world traveler, the husband, the father, the friend to many, and nationalist, has been rewarded with countless achievements and awards from all walks of life, both nationally and internationally. It's about background real quick. The child of the lucky parents of Okorie and Lady Hannah Chukudazie of Okija in Ihiala local government area of Anambra State, Dr. Daniel Wanneka Chukudazie was truly a New Year's gift to his parents when he was born on January 2nd, 1957. We know very little about his education, but I tell you one thing, it was godly. Having completed his early education, Dr. Daniel started on a path to establishing himself as a business mogul in Nigeria. While his parents and the rest of the world may not have seen this coming, it was very clear to him that his life would be dedicated to the service of mankind and the betterment of Nigeria and Africa. So from the beginning, Daniel took a clear stand and his decision became honored by God. He started his international business expansion in Taiwan in 1993. Shortly after that, he conquered Asia, where he is, has traveled and established partnerships in other countries like China, 